Okay, let us discuss this problem 10.4y. So this is the easy problem. So let us copy 10.45. So this says this is again something related to pressure. So question says. So how would you following compound prepare using the alcohol of your choice? So you have to prepare the following compound using alcohol. So using ROH, you have to prepare some compound. Let us say you have to prepare some compound A. So let us say first part. This says how can you prepare this compound? So you have a eight member ring. This compound. And then here you have CHO. So how can you prepare this compound using an alcohol? So can anybody give me the answer? Okay. So what can you do? You can do oxidation, PCC, pyridinium chlorochromate. So if you use pyridinium chlorochromate, so if you take a primary alcohol, CH2OH, and if you use PCC, pyridinium chlorochromate. You will get aldehyde because pyridinium chlorochromate is a mild oxidizing agent. So everybody knows this is a mild oxidizing agent. So if you use this, you will get the desired product. Now let us discuss B part. Please keep copying fast. So B part says you have to prepare this compound CH2Br. You can use alcohol. So you have to prepare. So this means uh, you have to remove something and you have to add Br. So this case you can use alcohol and use PBr3. So simple. So you can take this one CH2OH. Now if this compound react with PBr3, or you can take red phosphorus plus bromine, both will give the same product. Even you can use piece BR5, you will get the same compound. Let us discuss C part. So you have to prepare this compound OCS3. How can you prepare this compound using alcohol? So you can use O minus and then CS3 I attack. So can anybody give me the answer? Using alcohol, you have to prepare this compound. Okay, so what can you do is you take this alcohol. I think you are able to see. Now react with sodium. So you will have O minus. And once you have O minus, you treat with CH3I. Now this minus will attack. I minus will go. So you will get the desired product. Now let us do D. So D is. I think you are able to see. You have to prepare. So you have a six-member ring here, and then here you have chlorine. You have to attach a chlorine here, and here you have to attach CS3. How can you prepare this compound? So using alcohol. Simple. If you take alcohol and treat with PBr5, you will get the desired product. Are getting or not? So you treat with PCl5 or PCl3. You take alcohol. Here you have CS3 and here you have OH. You will get the desired product. Are getting or not? Let us see E. So if you want to do E, this case you have here I have double bond O. And here also I have double bond O. This side I have CS3 group. This side I also have CS3 group. I have to prepare this compound using alcohol. How will you prepare? So you know you should have a double bond here. If you take a double bond here, and if you do ozonolysis, either you can do reductive or oxidative. It does not matter because you are getting ketone. So let us take. Ozone analysis, zinc, H2O. You will get this compound. Now, how will you get this compound? 
from alcohol so of course simple so you can use dehydration of alcohol irrigating so if you use dehydration of alcohol you take this compound CS3 now there is no double bond uh, let us say let me remove double bond put OH CS3 H there is no double bond irrigating so this double bond is not there now if I do dehydration H plus heat dehydration of alcohol gives alkene so you will get the alkene irrigating or not so if you follow these steps you will get alkene in this case I think you are able to see this one let us do next F these are easy problem and that's why I am going slightly fast so F you have you have a 5 member ring and then COOH simple how can you prepare using this as alcohol so you take alcohol CH2OH and use KMnO4 so if you take this alcohol CH2OH and if you use KMnO4 or K2Cr2O7 it will finally go up to acid so either you can use KMnO4 or you can use K2Cr2O7 getting because these both are basically a strong oxidizing agent so either you can use KMnO4 or you can use K2Cr2O7 now I think I think all of you have copied this one please keep copying fast so let us say discuss Z I have this compound to prepare again easy problem so this is double bond O how can you prepare this from alcohol so I can take alcohol and then I will have here OH H and this is a secondary alcohol so either I can use KMnO4 or I can use K2Cr2O7 as a oxidizing agent so both reagent can be used I think you have copied this one let us keep copying fast those of you who have missed something from top please keeping uh, keeping this in your notebook so revise have you written something or not ok let us go for the next page so I will have the H so let us say H we have what we have to prepare is so this compound I have a double bond here and I have to prepare this from again alcohol simple one so this this time I can use dehydration of alcohol and that gives alkene so I will have this and let us say OH and if I use dehydration H plus heat this will give you the alkene are you getting on a simple one now let us say I so what I will have I have to prepare this compound and here I have CS3H and here I need OTS so this time you know I can treat alcohol with TSCL in the basic solution pyridine so TSCL in pyridine if I react with TSCL in the presence of pyridine I will get the desired product did you remember or not this reaction we have discussed in the class so here you have H CS3 H and here we will have OH and this reaction is basically used to make alcohol OH as a good leaving group this, uh, this time OH is not good leaving group now OTS is a good leaving group so this reaction is used to convert OH as a good leaving group so this reaction is used basically to convert OH as a good leaving group are you getting so this reaction can be used to prepare OH as a good leaving group now let us discuss next one so I have Z I think you have copied this one so let us say discuss Z I have this now I want here iodine how can I 
prepare this using alcohol so again you can use pi3 or simply red phosphorus plus i2 if pi3 is not a stable then you can use phosphorus plus i2 are you getting if you have alcohol oh and if you treat this alcohol with phosphorus plus i2 you will get the alkyl halide so these are the simple problem basically conversion from so these are the basically summary of reactions of alcohol so you see what are the possible reaction we have for alcohols alcohol can be dehydrated in this case alcohol can be made good leaving group in this case again alcohol can be used to make alkyl halide in this case so you see these are the reactions of alcohols we will go for the next problem i think you have copied this one please keep copying fast because these are the easy problem we cannot go very slow in these cases okay let us finish this one here